Game sale consoles, not high def DVDs. Let's talk about this for a minute. Executing information has a side video responsibly died. I left a comment on one of my videos about a dope new Chrome Studio 2. Windows hardware. Do I really like it? Somebody had a question about Booleans inside of Cheetah. So, okay, let's create a box. And I'm going to create a ball also. I'm going to make them both editable by double clicking on them. I'll select my ball. And I'm going to move it up like, like, uh, let's see here. Object mode. Let's move the ball up. Like so. And I'm going to stick it maybe right here, just as an example. This is the example they give in the help file. Okay, so now we have these two objects. So how do we give them to the Boolean with each other? Okay, well, if you go up here, you'll see you have a Boolean command. So I'll hit the Boolean command. You'll see it throws it in over here in my object browser. But what do I do with it? If I take my ball and drop it on the Boolean, the ball disappears. If I take my box and drop it on the boolean, the box disappears. If I take my boolean and drop it on the ball, nothing happens. Same thing with the box. You'll notice this works like Cinema 4D. So what we need to do to get this boolean to work is we need to take the one that we want to intersect with the other and drop them in in the right order. So I'm going to take the box and put it on top of the boolean. Take the ball and put it on top of the boolean. And now you'll see what we got. Let me back up. Let's put the ball on top of the boolean, then the box. Now you'll see the box is cutting out the sphere. So it depends on what order you throw them in there. So let's go ahead and boolean the box with the ball like this. So now we have these options up here. If we select our boolean, we can go up here and we can make A subtract B, A union B. We can make A intersect at this result. We can have a outside B, A inside B. Okay, so we'll just stick with this. And we got this. If you want to, you can go in there and double click it to make it editable if you need to edit it for any reason. And it throws in all kinds of polygons like that. So this is basically how our um, Booleans work inside of Cheetah. Um, I hope this helps. Not quite as elaborate as the Booleans inside of Modo, but when you see me using Booleans in Modo, this is how you'll go about doing it in Cheetah if you're a Cheetah user trying to follow along with me on my Modo tutorials. I'm here to help if I can. Just, just ask how to do certain things, and I'll try to translate it for you into the package if I own the package. Mostly Silo, Cheetah, and that kind of thing. I have Cinema and um, Houdini, but mostly transferring from Moto, I get questions about Cheetah and Silo. So there's our Booleans. See you next time.